Welcome back to the Tahoe Kitchen. I'm here with Shelly at the South Tahoe Utility District. So my dad always says there's two seasons in Tahoe, winter and construction. As the water and sewer district, are you doing any construction projects this summer? I love that saying. Yes, summer is a super busy time of year for South Tahoe Public Utility District. We have a short summer season, which means we are out and about replacing and repairing and installing new water and sewer facilities throughout our system. Um, one project that we're working on this summer is right here behind us. You can see we're installing a new emergency generator, both building and generator. So every single toilet that flushes in South Lake Tahoe flows here to our wastewater treatment plant where we clean it up. That means we're working 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year to make sure we're cleaning that wastewater. So reliable power is really important. So this emergency generator will be able to provide power during long, long power outages to run the whole wastewater treatment plant. So you're doing some construction on the sewer side. Right. You're building an emergency generator. What about the water side? Yeah, so on the water side, one of our high priorities is always replacing these old water lines to make sure our whole community has access to safe, clean drinking water. So over the last two years, we've been in the Ponderosa and Marlette neighborhood, uh, moving and installing a new water main in the street. The old water mains used to be in the backyards. So this summer, we're connecting those 80 homes to the new water main in the street. So what about water meters? I know my neighborhood is supposed to get a water meter soon. Do you know anything about that? Yes, so California law requires all um, water districts with over 3,000 connections to install water meters by 2025. So we have been working really hard on this project. This summer marks the fifth phase of our water meter installation project. So we expect to install about 1,200 water meters this year and then next summer, we'll wrap up our water meter project by installing about 250 more. I know there's a lot of construction happening on Sarah Boulevard. Do you know anything about that? Yeah, so the city of South Lake Tahoe is doing a really exciting project on Sierra Boulevard. They're narrowing the streets, adding bike lanes and multi-purpose lanes, installing stormwater infrastructure facilities. It's going to be excellent. So we collaborate with the city. So when they have the street torn up, we want to get in there and do projects underneath the street. So on Sierra Boulevard, we're installing water meters and water services. And the, the reason we're doing that now is um, since the street is already torn up, we can get in there, do fixes to try to minimize leaks. And then hopefully we won't be tearing up Sierra Boulevard over the next few years because um, we've addressed the issues. Ma'am, so you've been really busy. Is there anything else you've been working on? Yeah, I'd say the last big project we're working on this summer is Heavenly Tank. It is a one million gallon tank, our third largest in the system. And we're working this summer to recode it. And what that does is it prevents it from, uh, from corrosion, both inside the tank, there's one million gallons of water, and then outside the tank also, all the rain and snow throughout the year. Uh, so the Heavenly Tank is really important because it serves Heavenly Ski Resort, who's our largest water customer. So we, we're working really hard to make sure that project is completed by this fall so Heavenly is able to make snow this winter. Thanks, Shelly. We'll be back with more Tahoe Kids Show.